And if you were planning to uh, hit the road with those many, many people on the road, <laughs> the you want to know what it's feeling like outside. Ron is here to talk to you yes. all about it. Right now, I think you could roll down those windows, save a little gas. That's always yeah. important. But earlier or later on in the day, forget about it. It's not going to happen. Uh, roll right. up the windows, crank that AC. You're going to need it. Taking a look outside right now, we're looking at a pretty good 79 degrees. That's why I think windows are in order. A southwesterly breeze about three measly miles per hour. That's about it, folks. Sorry, that's all we got. But what I want to do is um, eventually take us to the tropics in just a few. Right now, though, we're looking at 79 degrees in Oklahoma City. Not bad there, or 79, I should say, and 70 or 69 there in Amarillo and in Abilene, 78 degrees. And temperature-wise, for us, again, we're not so bad. We're looking at the upper 70s for us. Going out to the lake, I say go for it. Today's a great day to go ahead and do something like that. Lake Buchanan, though, we're kind of almost working in the deficit range right about here. Lake Travis, so we're up three, which is actually down almost three feet from even about a month ago. Our Viper satellite, I want to go ahead and show you something on our Viper satellite as it regards to this. Now, notice how right here we are beginning to see an eye start to form. It's getting pretty thick right there. The yellow indicates heavier rain showers, a little more to look at as far as this system itself. Now, this is tropical. Depression 6 at this point. It is expected to intensify and become a tropical storm and then even a hurricane within the next three days or so. Now, how will this affect us? We'll zoom out just a little bit, pull this down, we'll clear out a little circle there, and show you its proximity to us. See, obviously, we're right here, the storm itself right here. And when storms like this start this low in the latitudes, a lot of times they will take an upswing and go this way, if you can follow my little arrow. So it could be more of an East Coast problem more than anything at this point. And our clouds and radar forecast for us not doing so bad at all. Maybe just showing a few clouds here and there, but really moving out of the way. I think it's more overstated more than anything as far as our cloud cover goes. And even into the evening hours, maybe just a storm here and there for the northern sections, but that's about it. So moving along into the lows tonight, 77 degrees, 77 force in Rockdale, 77 in Giddings, 77 force across the board. Our highs tomorrow, 102 at the airport, no doubt. We're going to stick in that triple digit range for quite some time. And of course, that's unfortunate. 103 today for our high, 79 for our low. And the next seven days look to be actually wet. And we do have a system coming this way, a low front, which will hopefully dip its way down here, or low pressure system, I should say, in a cold front, and some rain by midweek. I'll have more on your forecast in a little bit. Stay here.